Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study about parity generator and parity checker. When some information is transmitted from source to destination, then error can occur during transmission because bit values may change from 1 to 0 or 0 to 1 due to noise during transmission. Such types of error should be detected at destination. Now to detect such types of errors, an extra bit called parity bit is sent with message to make the total number of ones either odd or even. In odd parity, the parity bit makes the number of ones odd. Suppose the original message is 0101. Here the number of ones is even. So the parity bit would be 1. Now when this parity bit is sent with message, there would be odd number of ones in the message. If original message is 0, 1, 1, 1. Here message has odd number of ones. Here the parity bit will be 0. When this parity bit is sent with message, then message will have odd number of ones. Now, when this message reads destination, then at destination, message including the parity bit is checked if it contains odd number of ones or not. If number of ones is not odd in the message received at the destination, then it means there is some error. Now for even parity, parity bit makes number of ones even. And at destination, message including the parity bit is checked if it contains even number of ones or not. If number of ones at destination is not even, then it means there is some error in the message. Now, there is a combinational circuit called parity generator at the transmitter. This parity generator generates parity bit for the messages. It takes original message as input and generates the parity bit for that message. Transmitter transmits message along with its parity bit which is generated by the parity generator. At receiver, there is a combinational circuit called parity checker. Parity checker takes received message including the parity bit as input and it gives output 1 if there is some error formed and it gives output 0 if no error is found in the message including the parity bit. Now, parity method can detect only odd combination of errors in messages. It cannot detect even combination of errors in messages. For example, if number of ones in message including the parity bit is odd and its two bits have been changed during transmission, then at receiver, number of ones will remain odd in message. So this error would not be detected. 
For example, suppose suppose sender sends the message including the parity bit 1101. Here the number of ones is odd. Now suppose these two bits 10 gets changed during transmission. This 0 becomes 1 and 1 becomes 0. Then the receiver will receive the message 1011. Now this message has error but it would not be detected by parity checker because this message has odd number of ones. So even combination of errors in messages are not detected by parity method. Thank you very much.